actually against, well, I and many of us were against what's at the core of pushing these people from the land? Like, what is at the core of pushing people from the Middle East from their land? War. We're actually into the war. We're against this international finance that pushes this fight wars on these people. We want their, we want their lands to be back to the way they were. We want them to be able to live where they were at without being pushed away. Without this war. We, we're, we're not these, like, huge Trump cheerleaders. I, mean, I know we're here, but, like... We're here protesting Muslims. No, we're not protesting Muslims. Because, it, because it's, it's a two-sided... It's two sided. It's two -sided. No, it's not. Wait, what is it? It's not. It's not. There is no Sharia. We're anti war. Good. Let's keep it that way. Let's keep it that way. Exactly. Let's keep it that way. If you look, they are. If you look to what's happening in Europe, it's happening all over. There's no. We're here. How long is all it's here? I think that's. This is a cold part. Yeah. Nothing's going to happen. Everything should be on. Yeah. At the core of it. Look at this anti-Sharia. It's a moniker. It's a cold war. You're making a big leap. Yeah, you're, you're, no, you're attributing intent. I don't believe. You're making a leap. You are, you are attributing intent. You are saying, you know why we're here better than we do. We're not going to be saying xenophobic, racist, Islamophobic. That's what we are. We are pro-LGBT, pro-women's rights, and that's why we're anti I think a lot of us uh, will have you come and give you more than part of our movement. We can actually agree with them. I have we are pro-gay. So you don't support Sharia then? So you don't denounce Sharia law today? Denounce, can you denounce right here? You don't Sharia law? You do support Sharia law. If you don't, then denounce it. Can you denounce Can you denounce Hamas? Can you denounce Mohammed? I think between the two, those are what we have a problem with. That I'm a terrorist, that I'm a terrorist. That you're attributing intent again. I'm, I'm doing the you're saying you're saying that you know well, our motivations, but you're no. What you're saying is that we're racist. Are at odds with each other. But do you even know what Sharia means? Sharia means the law. So yeah, it's a religious law. But a lot of it's a religious law that condones the executing of homosexuals, the stoning of women. If you want to talk about rape culture, Sharia law is rape culture. I was very. I was very angry yeah. right when, right when Trump decided to leave. Was this proportionate to the population? Right. There's more Syria in Syria okay. and bomb all these nations. I, I don't support them. I wanted to. The whole point of me supporting Trump was that he was going to get us. Are they joining us in a fight? We're on the same team. We're on the same team. We're on the same team. It's not true. 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 But I needed to come here to also oppose the other part of that, which is pushing extremists into our streets. Then why are why are news agencies? You say you're pro LGBT. Why are you standing with a KKK flag? That's not a KKK flag. It's not a KKK flag. That's the Kekistani flag. You you should probably do a little research before you go spouting off about things you know nothing about. What? That's Why? Like but well, why are you saying, well, you're assuming we're members of the KKK without actually, has four Ks, it has four Ks, and it's green. There are none. There are none. There are none. You can't just say that I'm a white supremacist and poof, I become a white supremacist. I am not. I work in the I work in the a white supremacist. Sir, oh, is it? What is it? What does that flag stand for? They do. Sir. They know exactly what Sir, what is that? Flag. Yeah. What does that flag stand for? My business partners are gay. Well, you keep repeating yourself. You must have a real low IQ. I am the antithesis. What does that flag represent? You guys are so worried about Shidiya. There's no Shidiya in America. Thank God. Muslims in America. Good. But you know it's a bigger threat, white supremacy. So really? How many, how many people? When's the last time you saw a KKK riding up to a college on a horse? People come up and down the street with American flags. Not in our neighborhood. American flags? Oh, God, no. In America? Tell them us to go home. Tell them us to go home. I don't agree with that. I don't agree with that. Are people knocking on your door? Are people knocking on your door? I'm telling you to go home. Is the IRS asking Yes, I pay taxes. Of course the IRS is asking where my money comes from. What are you talking about? This is going nowhere. This is going nowhere. Of course I. I people knock on my door and I have to. We're on the same team. We're on the same team. You support you. No one's threatening you. So then we're on the same team. You just answer the question. I don't think you're. Should we allow? We'll never come to the 
Good. 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 White supremacy has hurt. I'm sure. I'm sure. Yeah, because it's it's 1882 and the KKK is a thing, right? Yeah, it is a thing. You watch, you don't need a hood. What's the last time you saw KKK members? You don't need a hood to to be racist. But you just say everyone disagrees with me is racist. You're racist. You're a pedophile. She's a pedophile. See, I can just make up shit too. to me that the left is so pro-gay rights, pro-women's rights, anti-rape culture, all of this, and then we're out here protesting an actual patriarchy, actual rape culture that is Sharia law, and then we're called racist and bigots and all of this. It's just baffling to me. The hypocrisy just, it, it, it's astonishing how they don't see their own hypocrisy. Very generous. Is there anything you want to say to the group? No. I mean, I'm not here to hate on anyone or or oppress anyone or anything like that. I'm just here to speak my mind. I'm here to show a little support for the American patriots out here that are attacked regularly being called racist, homophobic, sexist, so all these buzzwords that have no meaning behind them because they're, they're just saying it to insult you, just saying it to put you down because that's how the left debates nowadays. And can, I, can you just tell me that uh, you give me permission to film? Yeah. You have permission to use this for whatever you want. Thank you.